Okay, so hello, welcome back, everyone. Um, it's the closing session. Sorry about the end, the last end there. Uh, my laptop overheated, which reminds me of when in Brussels the um, what the network room caught fire and we lost Wi-Fi for a day. But uh, the tech team always sort things out. I think my laptop's cooled down enough. Um, so it's almost the end, sadly, as State of the Map 2021. But we're going to um, have a look back at the last three days. Um, there's lots of thank yous to do that made this happen. Um, and then we'll talk a bit about what's next for State of the Map. Um, so if I press the right button, um, oh, not that one. That one. Um, so it has been a fantastic conference um, on Twitter. Some stats I got there were 307 people tweeting. Um, seems to be a reach of almost a million. Um, and I think at one point watching the public live stream, so not the people in the ticket venue list, we had a peak of 80 people. Um, so that's been quite exciting. I'm pressing the wrong thing again. Um, if you did get a ticket and you were joining us on Venulus, it peaked. There was a peak at 230 people joining all together. I know some of you came in and went. The benefit of all being online is people from different time zones can join in. Um, there were over 130 questions for the main talk. Um, some of these stats are from the start of Sunday, so uh, probably more like 150 or more. Of questions. We had 10 of the self-organized sessions. So in addition to our program, there were breakout discussions um, along with the post-talk uh, chit chats. There were more than 300 messages in the global chat on Venulus and a real uncountable number of emoji reactions. I think you all like that, putting in your your different flags and your your th not just thumbs up, but using flag emojis and and fire engines when my laptop overheated and all sorts of things. So a great new we could express us. Um, you can still get a t-shirt if you go on the wiki. There's with depending what region you're in, people will have set up different shops. Um, so your t-shirt or even mugs in some cases and and different things. You don't have to use it, pretend you're a fashion model like me. Um, you can just enjoy wearing the shirt and smiling about your love for state of the map and treatment map. Um, and as you can see in my background, I've got a few from the past conferences. So they do really last um, when you see people at the conference or at your local map, the meetup and like, oh, you were at that conference. You know, I recognize the logo. Um, and uh, yeah, so if I click the right, um, I'm going to hand over to Emily now, who's um, going to tell us about some of the thank yous that uh, are really deserved here for State of the Map. Yes, hello. Thank you, Gregory. Yeah, uh, so this event will not be possible without you. So yeah, thank you, everyone. And uh, I'm just going through some of the uh, Rockstar volunteers during State of the Map. Next slide, please. Yes, uh, first, uh, thank you for our sponsors, Facebook, Mapbox, Esri, uh, Next Billion AI, Grab, and Google, along with our silver and bronze sponsors. Next one is, yeah, the session volunteers who help us uh, during the sessions. Uh, they are the hosts, those who uh, volunteer for the video cutting and big blue button assistant, as well as info desk. I hope you can hear my, <laughs> like, yeah. So these are the amazing people uh, who help us through the session. Next slide, please. Give, him, give them a round of applause, even though we can hear it. <laughs> yeah, of course, our translation volunteers, thank you so, so much for all your help translating and making, uh, making our state of the map uh, more accessible through la live language translations. So yeah, there are over 40 translations done, not only uh, the translation volunteers, thank you as well to our, to our Mambo support assistant who were there uh, during 
uh, all the live translations. Slide, please. And then, yeah, the program committee volunteers who really uh, handpick or really got a keen eye to pick our pick our uh, program and give us the very best of the best session talks, uh, workshops, and panel discussion. Next slide, please. Yeah, they are a lot. So yeah, th these are all just uh, there. Some of their amazing uh, work. Next slide, please. And of course, the academic committee and the video team. <laughs> uh, thank you all for all the good work you've done streaming the pre recorded talks. Next slide. And also, yeah, uh, this will not be possible for the tools for the conference. Uh, um, the venueless platform, the, the pretalex, and also the pretext for ticket management. Thank you. Next slide. And yeah, these are the core uh, SOTM working group. They meet like at least once a week to make uh, or to plan for this. So thank you to Christine, our state of the map chairwoman and lead, also to Mikel for leading the coordinations for sponsors, and also to Manfred, who also is in the uh, program committee, who takes care of the videos, who also takes care of the OSM wiki page and more. And of course, uh, for Martin, who is who are the head of uh, doing all the website making sure that the website is up and running, and also uh, the academic track co-chairs, Marco and Yair. And yeah, to my team, Enoc and Frederica, uh, thank you. We are the communication team. We are the ones tweeting and also uh, the ones you also see in the mailing list. So yeah, thank you for bearing with us. Next slide. And of course, yeah, this will not be possible without the speakers, the pres the speaker presentations, workshops, and panel discussions. Also, the amazing poster presenters and those who run self-organized sessions, even in the last minute. And everyone taking part in the chat, the questions, email, and on social media. Next slide, please. Okay, so um, yeah, lots of people that really make uh, happen. Um, there was the posters that you could submit in. We've got a few uh, displayed here, but you can still go to the website. I know they were um, being shown during the, the break slides, but um, if you want to look at them in detail, there are a few comments you need to be able to stick to them. Uh, you can do on our website. Um, we have a group photo. Normally at the conference, we all gather, we all stand back, and or someone would stand back on a ladder, someone take a photo. We want to say a bit like this. This is our third version already. So um, before you go to sleep tonight, uh, upload a photo um, or it and, and with the hashtag SOTM2021 and, and maybe have a group photo. Um, we'll put together a bigger what we can just share, share on, on the trend the, the way um, to, to see how many wonderful there were memories of joining and I, I think we did attend the conference even though it was online um but now we look a bit forward and ask what's next for state of the map um so the proceedings of the academic track i've been promised they're going to be published next week so you'll be able to read um in the way academic conferences often have um you'll be able to read about the sessions that were there um, the recordings uh, that we've done from the conference um, I will be on our YouTube channel as well as the State of the Map website um, in a short while. We're just cutting them up, and when there's been technical issues, uh, I think the video team are going to try and see what they can do to uh, fix some of those. Um, so just give them a bit of moment, a uh, bit of time, and you'll be able to re-watch talks or send them to people that you know. Uh, we'll find them interesting. Um, and we're also going to try and make the translations go up there because I think that's great for uh, pushing this knowledge to as many people as possible. 
Um, next year, so we don't have a venue yet. Um, we want to go around the world, as always. You can I look at my shirts to see we've been in Birmingham, in the UK, in Tokyo, um, in Heidelberg, in, in Brussels. Where should we go next year? Um, I have hinted to a couple of places of great communities. Um, if you've got a team that want to volunteer, you've seen in our thank yous some of the roles it takes. Um, so you've got about a month. There's lots of help on the wiki there on how to put in your bid, what sort of information we need to know. And you can also message the committee. Um, you know, you don't have to be private or worried. If you just got questions, ask us. We want to help you with our bids um, and we'll see where it is. Hopefully we will be able to do it in person um, next year. We'll we'll see how that goes. But also maybe you're from a small, nobody lives near you. You don't think you've got the people to host. Um, you can still volunteer as an individual to help on those teams. Um, as this year proves it was people all around, all around the world helping in different ways. Um, so, you know, it's easier once we know where the, the main core local team is um, and you can contact um, us through the website. Um, the email address is there to say you want to volunteer and, and maybe how you want to volunteer. Um, if you do want to know where we'll be next year or what the dates will be and you're not on the newsletter, um, make sure you go to the website and scroll down to where it's got that nice little box Sign up for the email update, put your email address in, and you'll all be updated. Um, I think we're also going to try and send out a feedback um, form to know what was good and what we can improve on in this conference. Um, and so we'll send that out to our email list. So if you've already been getting our emails, then that probably means you're on the list. Um, and also social media, you know, we make use of Twitter a lot. Um, the communications team has been really helpful on that, on, on posting things out. So you can follow us on Twitter, um, as well as the main, you know, OpenStreetMap feeds that we try and share this knowledge. Um, and we're on the wiki. I've shared a lot of information and a lot of links. Um, if you go to the OpenStreetMap wiki, wiki.osm.org, um, there's a state of the map page. It's got all these links to help you out. Um, and it, if you blogged about um, about your time at OpenStreetMap or or you want to share extra links from your talks, you can also add it onto there. Can be helpful. Um, we're a community that really helps in in sharing that. Um, so that's it. I'm gonna. We've got some of our volunteers here. Um, I think we're gonna switch to to show us all the ones that. See you next year.